In this recipe video, you'll learn how to make a mixed berry galette with pie dough. Hi, it's Jenna here from Sit, Bite, Go, and today I'm going to show you how to make this super easy cherry and blueberry, I always forget the word, I want to say gazette, but that's like a newspaper, it's a galette with an L first. So this is a cherry and blueberry galette which in my house is basically the French word for super easy pie that I can make in about 10 or 15 minutes. So I'm gonna show you how to make this tasty little item. Uh, all you really need is some pie crust that you can buy frozen or in the refrigerator section of the store, some fresh berries. I used half cherries, half blueberries, but you could use any berries that you like, and a couple of other ingredients to thicken up the fruit so it stays in this really nice kind of like jelly form once you cut it. So anyways, this is one of my favorite recipes to make in the summer or whenever the berries are ripe. It's so delicious and it tastes really good with a scoop of ice cream. Let me show you how I made it. So in a large mixing bowl, I added the cherries, blueberries, brown sugar, cornstarch, lemon marmalade, although you can use lemon juice if that's what you have, vanilla extract, salt and cinnamon into the bowl. And then once they're all in there, you mash them together until the cornstarch is no longer white, so the juices have absorbed all of the cornstarch. Then you take a nine inch pie dough crust, you only need one crust for this, you put all of the fresh berries and the mixture in there, and then you fold the pie crust around the mixed berries and form a nice little pie shape. Then it goes into the oven where it's going to bake at 375 degrees for almost an hour. And when it comes out, it's ready to serve. You just got to let it cool like 15 or 20 minutes because it will be hot and then it's easier to slice. I like to serve it with some fresh berries on top. Here I had some cherries remaining. And although it is quite rustic looking, believe me, it smells and looks delicious. Stop pouncing! Well, I hope that I've inspired you to make this super easy cherry and blueberry galette. And um, I guarantee it's much more delicious than it may look. It's kind of a rustic looking pie thing but it's also way simpler than baking an entire pie, and I bet it will be gone in just one or two nights in your house too. Well, check out Sip Bite Go for some more delicious recipes to make this season, and I hope that you have a wonderful day. Cheers!